have here in Los Angeles. But as you know, we're prohibited you know, from commenting about other teams' players, so I'll have to not even begin to answer the question. Um, but the free agency is not over. I mean, there things could happen in the next two days. Well, t today, actually last night at 9 o'clock, was the beginning of when you can start signing players. So there's a lot of activity between 9 o'clock last night and today. And uh, it'll continue for the next day or so, and then it'll slow down a little bit. But it's a very busy time of year for us. Do you think you'll make more new moves with this team? I think we will. Uh, our roster is not complete. Uh, I, I believe we have a good, a very good starting five, and uh, we didn't have a great bench last year, and uh, I think we have to look to improve our bench a little bit. So we have challenges in front of us, and um, you know, we're hopeful in the next couple of weeks you know, we'll be able to figure it out. What sort of needs do you think the bench has? Excuse me? What, what sort of needs do you think the bench lacks? Uh, that you would hope to fulfill? Well, I mean, um, a, a lot of it has to do with, um, you know, our coach and how many minutes, you know, the guys are going to be playing. Uh, of the five starters, you know, one is under 30 and uh, the other four are above 30. I don't think any of them will ever ask to play less. Uh, so, but we're going to have to manage minutes. And therefore, you're going to have to have guys that come off the bench. You know, that, that could do no worse than keep things at the same level they were before they, the starter left the court. Uh, you hope to get a player that could add, you know, coming off the bench. Uh, so that'll be a challenge. And I mentioned earlier the restrictions with the new collective bargaining agreement make it difficult. But, you know, we'll find a way to improve the team. What's your confidence level that you can hit another home run? Well, I mean, the home, the home run thing, you know, is an expression that I think every general manager, you know, tries to do during the offseason. And um, only looking back on it in five or six years will we actually know whether or not, you know, this team as presently constructed is a great team and therefore is a home run. But, you know, going into the offseason, every general manager tries to get that one player that can dramatically improve their team. Um, if you could get one every five or seven years, you've done pretty good. So we think we got one this year. So you're asking me, can we do that twice? I'm not quite sure that's possible. You mentioned a, a priority of wanting to retain your own guys on July 1st, calling out you know, <clears> to Ramon and Jordan, guys like that. Uh, where do things stand with Andrew in terms of the contract extension? Um, the last time I spoke to his representative, um, really didn't um, begin to address you know, I think everybody understands that this time of year, you know, with the draft and um, leading into July 1st, which is free agency and everything that takes place, uh, in, due t in due time that will be addressed. And um, maybe not in the next day or two, but hopefully in the next couple of weeks, you know, we could sit down when we get through this period um, and try to address the things that are most urgent. Not, not that any one of our starters' futures are not urgent, but there'll be a time and a place for that. Are you hoping to bring Jordan Hill back? Uh, we've been in discussions with Jordan's representative, who coincidentally is Bill Duffy. He's here today, so maybe I'll have a conversation with him today. I apologize if you already answered this, but what is the likelihood, do you think, of Ramon being retained, even if Steve now? I think that's unlikely. Before July 1st, you talked about wanting to hit a home run. You clearly did that with Steve. Are you done, or are you still swinging for the fences? Well, um, once again, you know, whether or not this is a home run, we'll have to look back on it four years from now and, and see exactly how we you know, progressed and how we played as a team. Uh, I do think that we've made ourselves a better team with a better chance to succeed this year. Um, having said that, you know, we hope we're not done. You know, there's a lot of issues that have to be addressed on our team in terms of our bench, even if we stay pat with the starting five we have. So we'll work on those things and you know, try to remain patient, which is something this organization, you know, really has, takes great pride in doing. You know, they don't panic. You know, ownership with uh, Dr. Buss and Jimmy Buss, you know, they display great moments of patience and looking for the right deal. Um, sometimes there's criticism that goes along with that. Um, but when there's a decision that needs to be made and it's the right to decision, they always step forward. If you do go into the season with this starting lineup, how, how good do you feel about that? I think a lot of it has to, to do with staying healthy. You know, can we improve our bench? Uh, I think we'll win a bunch of games. You know, and then during the playoffs, you know, you need a little bit of luck too. But all you can do is try to put yourself in the hunt. You know, no, nobody can make 
uh, free agent signings or deals that guarantees a championship. That's not possible. It's so much more difficult than that. Yes, I'm sure you've been asked, but uh, can you say anything about the possible Dwight Howard negotiation? No, nope. NBA prohibits it. You mentioned after the exit interview the possible reluctance of using the amnesty provision. Does that sentiment still stand? Say it again. You mentioned uh, after your exit interview uh, the, your reluctance to use the amnesty Correct. provision. Does that sentiment still stand as far as using that this summer? As of today, that still stands, yes. Well, I, I, I'd like to get off the home run. Okay. <laughs> I, I did. I did. Uh, but it's an expression. And they're, 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 they're so hard to make. Um, and if you can make one every five or ten years, you know, you got to look at your organization and say you're very, very lucky. You know, and uh, to assume that, that, that you can... You know, continue to do that in a in a smaller window under today's rules. Uh, it's just not realistic. It's not realistic. There are high expectations. Yeah. So so we'll continue to try. Yeah. You know, chicks dig long walks. Chicks dig the long walk. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You would know. <laughs>